Hello, in this video we discuss integrating your point of sale system with CAS label printing scales. CAS label printing scales are a very popular product. They allow you to print out a label with a barcode and that barcode integrates with your point of sale system. We're going to go ahead and look at this first label printer. These are great for delis and markets and grocery stores and they provide a lot of detail that prints out on a label and you can configure what text you want to have on there and the price and, and the final price and the unit price and it's going to show also the weight or the, the number of units that you're providing. So the limitation of the l these label printing scales is that the code that you're going to scan that, that ties into your point of sale system does not include the quantity so when you scan this item the trick is how do you get your point of sale to know the quantity to reduce your inventory that you have in the point of sale so to demonstrate here we have this code if you can't read it it says 20001 that's the PLU number that's the lookup that identifies beef round steak the second portion identifies the price, the 1713, so that's 07, sorry, 01713, then it's got a 3 at the end here. So the 573 in the pounds is not anywhere within this section, so your system is going to have to do the math to extrapolate what the price would be per unit, 299 if you're providing 5.73 pounds. This is a very overlooked feature when uh, when many people try to integrate their point of sale system. So we're going to demonstrate how this uh, might look on most common standard point of sale systems and then we're going to go ahead and show you uh, what happens when you have a full integration. Okay so here we are at the point of sale system and we can scan this item, that, that code that we just mentioned, the 20010171333. So what you'll see with most point of sale integrations is that they'll accept the PLU to look up the item and then assign the price that's indicated on the label to indicate the price in the, in the process of the sale. So what happens is the if the system doesn't know the unit price and can extrapolate that weight from the unit price it can't come up with a quantity so many systems will provide a quantity of one a unit price of the price you saw on the label 1713 and then a total price of 1713 that's because the barcode does not tell you the quantity so now we're going to switch over and, and set it up so that the system, the point of sale system, will extrapolate the quantity from 1713 because it knows that the total price here is 1713. It can look up the unit price of beef round steak and then come up with the quantity being 5.73. So when we scan, we now see the quantity of 5.73 for the pounds, the 2.99, the beef round steak, and the price of 17.13. So for the full integration that has to happen, you not only be need to be able to read that barcode, but then extrapolate the quantity out of it. So if you're a little bit unclear on how that worked, we can look up the item in our system by using the search feature, beef round. Here we see that the barcode was 20001. It's, it's only a part of that lookup code. The label provides the rest. We have the price programmed in here. So the math to get the quantity is the quantity is equal to the total price divided by the lookup price of 299. 
which then gives us the quantity of 5.73. If you'd like to see more tips and tricks on how to set up your point of sale, reach us at cafecartel.com or our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash ccspos, or give us a call at 866-973-8099. We look forward to hearing from you.